What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? I am your host, Smith, Blacksmith89, and welcome to my YouTube channel. So, it has officially begun. The race for the PS5. Pre-orders went up yesterday. It was supposed to go up today, but motherfuckers decided to do it yesterday. Mind you, Sony niggas said, excuse me, that we would have time to get our PlayStation 5, so don't worry. Everything will be okay. Put our minds at ease. So, yesterday was Sony's showcase. They showed a lot of game gameplay. Uh, you know, Spider-Man Miles Morales looks amazing. I will be getting that for the PlayStation 5. Call, Call of Duty Cold War looks amazing. I will be getting that for the PlayStation 5. I'm upset because I was told that today will be official release date. PlayStation 5 right now, as of now, has been officially sold out when it comes to pre-orders. Pre-orders have been sold out since yesterday. Yesterday. You would have to be one lucky bitch to get your hands on the pre-orders for the PlayStation 5. I guarantee you everything is sold out. Controllers, everything. Media, the media stand, the media remote. The charging station. Everything is sold out. So, whether it's digital or the physical, it's all gone. Pre-orders are done. You can't get a pre-order to save your life. This is why Sony... I don't understand why the fuck would you lie about that. I mean, we all been looking forward for this. We all have our money saved up and ready to go. And you basically bamboozled us, told us everything will be okay, and now we can't get a PlayStation 5 to save our life. November 12th is when it's going to be released in the United States, Japan, Canada, Mexico, Australia, New Zealand, and South Korea, November 12th. So I say unto you, my friends who live in America, who was asked out on the pre-order because we got lied to. I say this, November 11th, you better camp the fuck out outside all night. Do what you have to do. Camp out. Camp out. Camp out. I don't care. Do what you got to do. Am I a little heated right now? Yes. Yes, I am. If everything would have gone according to schedule today... I would have gotten my pre-order for the PlayStation 5. But now, I have to camp out. November 12th is the worldwide release of the PlayStation 5. Make sure you have your money ready. Make sure you have your money ready. Here's what you do. If you know you literally just have enough, I would say... For the PlayStation 5 and maybe one or two games. Buy the games early. Get them out the way so you could just go in there, pay for the PlayStation 5, and be done. See, right off the bat, I already know what games I'm getting. I'm getting Spider-Man, Miles Morales, and Call of Duty Cold War. Those are the only two games I'm getting. So, with that being said... November 11th, camp the fuck outside. Do what you gotta do. Don't waste your time trying to pre-order online. Do what you gotta do. Me, personally, I'm upset that these motherfuckers told us we have nothing to worry about. All you gotta do is just fucking wait until today. Everything was supposed to go live today, 8 a.m. 8 a.m. But no. Shit's been sold out since last night. I've been trying all night leading up until this morning to get a pre-order for the PlayStation 5. Sold the fuck out everywhere. And it's like, what the fuck? But I'm still a faithful Sony pony. Well, we changed our names to the Stallions now. No more Sony ponies. Sony Ponies is out. Stallions is in. Shout out to Marlin Gaming Nation. Oh my god, bro. I'm just fucking like, really? 
Are you fucking kidding me? I've been trying half the night. I didn't get no sleep. If you can see the bags under my eyes right now, because I've been trying, I've been busting my ass to try to get a pre-order, and I'll be damned if I'm going to take my hard-earned money and go to some janky-ass um, third-party website that's selling the PS PS5, and it's like, no. eBay, forget about it. No. I'm not going to eBay. I'm not trusting eBay with that type of shit. You might think you're getting a PlayStation 5 and you might and you wind up getting a router that looks like the PlayStation 5. So, yeah, to avoid all that, November 11th, I am camping the fuck out. And another thing, it's like, Sony, what are you doing? If most of these games you announce going to PC or PlayStation 4, do I really need to bust my ass to go out here to get a PlayStation 5? Really? When I can just buy all these games on PlayStation 4? <sighs> Seriously? Seriously? But you know what? I'm a fan. I'm a fan. I'm going to... I'm going to buy PlayStation 5. Uh, Ghost of Tsushima was my last PlayStation 4 title that I said that I would ever buy. After that, I'm looking forward for PlayStation 5. But I just wanted to make a quick little rant video. I'm dead six minutes in. But you know what? Yo, I'm excited, pissed off, mad at the same time. Oh my God. But it's all gonna be worth it. I'm telling you now, if you really want to secure your PlayStation 5, I suggest you camp out November 11th. Seriously, camp out November 11th, wherever the PlayStation 5 is being sold at, camp out, camp out. Yes, I know we got COVID-19. Yes, I understand that. Make sure you camp out with all the things you need. Make sure you got your hand sanitizer, your gloves, your face, your face shields, and your mask. Always mask up, no matter what. I'm telling you, camp out. It's going to be worth it. You're basically risking it all by camping out all night. It's do or die right now, man. Do or die. PlayStation 5, next generation, man. Once you get it in your hand, I wouldn't give a fuck if I just got the control if I just got the controller and the console. Fuck it. I'll get everything else at a later date and time. But I'm pretty sure November 12th, they're gonna be coming out with these bundles. So make sure you have all of your money saved up and ready to go. So November 11th. Make sure you camp out. But this is all I got for right now. I just wanted to rant a little bit. So I'm your host, Mr. Smith, Blacksmith89. If you're new, please subscribe and hit the bell on your way out. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.